how's it going everybody it's me scott dog thank you very much for joining us as you can see we're back we're playing some more my gm mode and wwe 2k23 uh we i'm trying to figure out is the week after SummerSlam. it's always a bit of a weird week um because we have to try and figure out what we'll do to get people working together because things come to an end and then there's kind of things in progress that we're trying to do uh, and it's all a little bit tough so we've got to try and figure that out before we do that let's just see if there's anything new we'll come and book these 35k for that 10k for that 10k for that and that one um, power cards let's have a little look we've got superstar training trained one of your enhancement stars we'll have a look at that in a second coast to coast gm interference and we can fix a match which i think is quite nice one randomly booked Iron Man match will receive a higher rating than normal. Send one of your cho send a chosen superstar to uh, recover 18 stamina this week. We'll be busy for the week. I think we want to buy that one. Um, let's go and have a little look at what the hell we're going to do with our roster. Um, so we've got some rivalries. We've got Orton and um, Boogs, who are okay stamina wise, versus. Um, Gable and Steiner, who are also okay stamina-wise. So I think we've at least got one match. Sheamus is almost back to some kind of level of fitness, which is nice. Malassi and Rodriguez can be our one of our matches. So I think we go normal match, normal match. No, we make it tag, normal, and we say U2 versus... I didn't even look at the commissioner goal. We should go and do that. Um, who were we fighting here? Who was it? These two. What was the commissioner goal? Schedule a run-in of your most popular available star. On your most popular available star. Who is our most popular available star? It's Bala, who definitely isn't going to be fighting. In fact, we probably need to send you for rehab, right? In fact, we should probably just get that done now, but... Okay, what the heck is going to be our main event? You're resting for two weeks. You're knackered. Um, this is a level two rivalry, so I guess we could... I guess we could do this and give it a little twist with maybe tables or something. Okay. We are kind of just looking for, for for cheap ones that we can get away with. Your stamina is knackered. Um, you two. So Seamus is knackered still. You're knackered, you're knackered. We could have Anderson. Where's Gable? He's still here, or is he gone somewhere? Is in that is in that match. Um, so we could have you, and we could have you fighting. Hold on, you're a fighter. You're a cruiser. So we can't have you fighting either of these. That's that's annoying. So we're already talking about hiring new people. Can't do anything with you. Can't do anything with you. Otis versus. What is Otis? Otis is a bruiser, right? Some of these are so difficult, right? Otis, he's a bruiser. So we really need him against a fighter. We don't have a fighter on the books. We could try and get Otis versus Bala being our next rivalry. Maybe that's a thing. Okay. And then what if we had someone call out Charlotte? Charlotte's a specialist. We need someone new for Charlotte, right? Who could fight Fury? You're a, a fighter. So you really need to go against a bruiser, which we don't have. So we're looking for someone to fight Charlotte, which would be a anybody. 
I mean, we could use one of you lot, right? What if we got you to call out you? What if we got you to call out you? Okay, so that should hopefully start another rivalry. Who does that leave us with? That leaves us with Perez, who's a cruiser. So if we could find a giant lady, that would be good. Stamina is 100 down here. We really need to find someone to fight you. Um, what if we turned you into a... No, that doesn't work. Okay, so we need someone to go up against a fighter. You're still knackered, so I can't put you in. We've got a fighter here versus a bruiser. We made you, we had, gave you a, a change. We could put you in against you, right? We made you evil, you could go in about against the bruiser maybe. Do we want to go down that road? I'm not sure. Let's, let's have a think. So our, no, hold on. We want it in this one. Uh, our rubbish lady here, 31, Christina Fury is a fighter. So we need a bruiser to take you on. Let's go and have a look. Good bruiser. Oh, top dollar over here. Is top dollar a real person or a pretend person? Uh, specialist. Permanent, 130k. Do we want Nat Nat Natalia on the show? Lulu Tandy could be our... Oh, hold on, we've got a giant... We're saying you call out you, but we could... No, I think that's fine, right? Let's have a look at the legends. Lita, there's Brie Bella. Five weeks. There's Molly Holly. Do we want Molly Holly? Is that the, is that the show we want? It seems like a lot to book you in. What if we got an evil giant? Is there an evil giant? We really want to do something with you. Really want to do something with you. Oh man. My head hurts. Right. Where's my, where's my roster? So who's not in a match? It's you. You're a heel fighter. So we want either a uh, baby face specialist or bruiser. Special or bruiser. And we don't have any of those around here, right? And we're calling out Charlotte with you. Okay, so a babyface specialist or cruiser. It's Natalia, right? We don't really want to sign her on a permanent thing, I don't think, but maybe we do. Or Lula Tandy. Do we want Lula Tandy? Do we want Lula Tandy? Five weeks for 6k versus 100k over here. And there was no one in here, right? There was you. 50k for five weeks or 54k for five weeks. 
Hulk Hogan's over here. There's Scott's diner. We're going Lula Tandy. It's, it's done. All right. 6K, you're in. Fighter versus a bruiser. Cruiser versus a giant. Perfect. We could have a run in from maybe you. Don't know if that works, but it could be fun, right? Said you're running your most popular star. We're running in on someone else. Let's cancel the run in. How do we cancel the run in? Okay. So that's that one done. Now who the hell are we putting in a fight? Um, I don't know. I don't know who we're putting in a fight anymore. If we got you to change, you could take on him, right? I'm going to go for it. We'll get you to do a role change. And then in this one, I've got I've genuinely got no idea. We could get a female giant to take on you. Or we need new tag team people. So what if I just got another female to, to team up with you? Or do we need a completely new... I don't know how it works. Do we need a completely new tag team? Show has cost me a lot of money. Um, sorry, I appreciate this isn't this isn't really helping. Giant, you got a cruiser. Specialist would take on anyone. Um, your stamina is also pretty low. So we could. could just put in a crap match for the sake of putting in a crap match like these two they're completely the wrong sides of the argument we could go Seamus and just hope he doesn't get injured right we haven't got anything we can do to deal with that we do have injury rehab we have health spa as well which we should definitely use, right? On you. Okay, good. What if we... Train one of your enhancement talent stars to become a permanent superstar for your brand. Enhan What's an enhancement talent? Is that like the weakling people? If I go back to the book of show and we take this out for a second. Now, if I try to use that card. Yeah, it's these guys. Okay, interesting. So if we put that one back in. everything costs so much nowadays okay so if this was our show which is a bit rubbish i'll grant you if we then went and hired one of these people like if i sent him if i hired him a, a good fighter his enhancement talent right i assume but we could also get these guys like john the fisherman um, if we were to try and book our next few fights, our, our Finn Balor who needs a challenger, right? He's a fighter. We've got a bruiser here. We could do with another bruiser. Have I booked someone to call you out? I can't remember. Yes, Otis. So Otis, we're hoping we'll take on Balor. 
So who does that leave who needs an opponent? You're fighting him for now. Bruiser is going to take on him. You're in a battle. So it leads us needing someone to take on Eric, who's a bruiser. So is there a fighter who is a heel? No, but there is Chester. We could sign one of these and then turn them permanent. I mean, you've got already got good popularity, right? Does this card do anything else? Is it just enhances to become a permanent superstar? I think it makes sense to go Adrian Buck, right? Turn him into a heel. And then sign him permanently, I guess. This it cost 20 grand you're better off getting one of these cheap ones right we're better off getting one of these cheap ones like olaf ostrovsky or john the fisherman what about olaf let's get olaf i like the idea of olaf i'm not sure who we're going to fight him against we don't have any cruisers really um but let's hold off for a week <laughs> God damn it. I'm all over the place. I'm so sorry. Um, free advertising. I mean, we can't use that. Let's, let's hold off for a week. Our show is pretty poor. Hold on. We've completed three of these. Complete another commissioner goal and we'll be flying. Okay. Um, we're not going to book you against Seamus. I'm sorry. That's not going to help promise you some rest we're not going to tag team you with charlotte i'm sorry about that okay i think this is it right do we swap this round yours is a one-on-one -on -one. i wonder if we swap these round Hundred grand for this show. I suspect we're losing money. Here we go, everybody. Um, oh God. Okay, I apologise for the the humming and hawing over what we do over this one, but here we go. We have Raquel Rodriguez versus Sassy Malassi. Rodriguez is the winner in a two and a half star match. Not great, and it's um. Now a level three rivalry, which is good. Otis is calling out uh, Finn and doesn't get anything. Christina Fury versus Lula Tandy. Fury wins. Disappointing match. No rivalry. This is a rough week. Uh, hold on a sec, though. We've got Candice versus Charlotte. Level one. We needed that. We need this to grow for sure. Seamus wins. The rivalry grows. Two and a half star. Oh God. This is the worst show we could have put on. It's a really expensive one and we're really rubbish. You've turned evil. Love that. And now we've got this one. Um, do we want to watch? I guess we watch it. Rick Boogs versus Randy Orton versus Rick Steiner versus Chad gable for the titles here we go i have to say the week after a pay-per-view is really tough because you're like you're focused on your little rivalries you built them all up they all come to an end and you're like well now I, I can't put the same rivalries on i have to swap them around but none of them are the same none of them are the same type of fighters so you're really struggling there's orton we don't need to watch that we've seen that one before we definitely need, don't need to watch Boogs. We've seen that one before. Who's next? Here comes an amateur standout and a tag team specialist, Rick Steiner. His bark is bad and his bite much worse. 
There he is. No messing around from Steiner. go have we seen chat we must have seen chad gable right right Alpha Academy is in session. he's part of that other one i told you he's part of that with with whatever his name otis is Okay, good. Here we go. We are in and we're ready to go. A tables match, I think. Our show has been terrible. So bad. Oh, and with the, the miss. Oh, oh he's, he's going to jump on him from there. Surely he's going for a table. Oh. What the hell's happening? Boogs is getting the table. Orton's getting the stairs. How did he slide that under his feet? That was incredible. goes the stairs. Orton with the table. Orton drops the table. What the heck? What the heck was that? Boogs setting up the table. He's setting his table up and guys, someone's about to have a really bad night. Launches. There's a lot of hard ways. A reversal in the center of the ring. There goes Orton. Oh, the table's collapsed. Getting the table again. Oh, he almost went through it. There is a battle over the center of that table in the center of the ring. And here comes the second table. Oh my god, we're getting two tables set up. Oh. Oh, here we go. He's through it. Just a straightforward power slam. Orton and Boogs win again. It was a great match. The rivalry stays at one. Why can't we get any rivalries to grow? This sucks. Okay. That was a really poor, really poor week for us. If we get more than like 20,000 fans, I'll be surprised. Uh, okay. Big matches. None. They're all normal matches over here, which is kind of what you expect, right? We spent a lot of money and we shouldn't have done. Mediocre match. 
Okay, well, it's good to see at least they're having similar sort of problems to us. NXT, what have they got going on? Fools count anywhere at the bottom there. And then normal tables, normal and normal. Again, pretty cheap show being put on. Look at how poor our week was. Oh my God. Um, okay. Show quality D. Star power 13. Rating score 98. We got 41,000 fans. We did make 66k, which is a surprise to me. Um, what have we got? Lula Tandy, uh, the newest superstar on SmackDown. Never heard of her. Got a long way to go. I like tonight's snack. SmackDown. Keep it coming. Uh, I see Christina Fury was up to her usual dirty tricks against Lula Tandy. Yo, SmackDown know, know who deserves a championship on his waist? Carl Anderson. Great to see Rick Boogs in another tables match. Keep him coming. I liked that every match in this week's was felt different. Carl Anderson, a bad guy. Never saw it coming. Sheamus defending his Intercontinental Championship once again. Starting to feel a bit stale. Otis trying to lay down the law to Finn Balor in a promo that kind of sucked. Not much clear of a challenge. Jackson Smooth and no thanks to leeches out there. What? Um, okay. We've got 33,000 fans over here, but 96k in the bank. Uh, for NXT, we have 49,000 fans and 80k in the bank. And finally, for WCW, 63,000 fans and 100 grand in the bank. That is a huge week. Special promotion. Ensure that you retain most of your fans. Coast to coast GM interference. Okay, we got that twice. We are still top, but it's getting closer. Look at the money is closing in as well. Uh, and there's not a lot between all of us. There you go. Thank you so much for watching. Please hit the like button, subscribe button, follow us on Twitter at Scott Gaming. We'll see you again soon. Thank you.